<coughs> excuse me. Uh, they are very closely related to the Bichon. The Bichon is like their cousin. Uh, difference here, these guys have a straight coat, very straight coat. Uh, Bichons are waving. Uh, this coat in particular, we were talking about the teddy bear who had a wavier coat. So this coat in particular is a little bit finer. Catans are very soft. Uh, the, the word catan, um, which most people s pronounce as cotton, um, actually means cotton. Uh, it is French and actually means cotton or soft. And it's referring to the coat. So this coat is a very, very fine, soft coat. Uh, this does and will require uh, maintenance on your site again. Um, all of your dogs that shed very little do require maintenance on your site. Uh, so there is groom, uh, combing and grooming that has to be done to these guys. These guys more often uh, because their coat is straighter, because their coat is more fine in nature. So these guys will need to be combed out at least three times, uh, most likely four, uh, maybe even longer um, or more often I should say. Um, depending kind of on their activity level, what they're doing, uh, you know, if they're, if they're being very active, and of course they're puppies, so they're going to be, but if they're being very active and running around, they're rolling on the ground, tumbling up, like this little guy's sitting on the ground right now. So his belly is going to be a candidate for uh, kind of nodding up, all right, because he's, he's laying on the ground, he's moving around like he is playing with his toy, but what that's doing is that's twisting that hair that's on his belly, you know, and, and these guys, of course, will do the same thing. Uh, just their hair is a little bit finer than his is, so we do have to uh, keep keep in mind and watch that. Now your Catan...